Hey guys, out here at uh, Saguaro Lake today. Yep, you heard right, Land of the Giants. We're just out here trying to catch a fish or two and uh, hopefully maybe a bigger one. But I'm gonna start out today with drop shot. Um, so I've got the bobber stopper drop shot on. I'm gonna vary my, vary my bit distance on, uh, you know, whether they're real shallow or they're deeper. Now on the cliffs like this, I like to fish a deeper drop shot like this. So I've got uh, a bobber stopper on the top and two on the bottom. And the trick is open up the clasp of the drop shot weight with a knife and then uh, tie it on, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna do like we've done before in our shows, is all we're gonna do is we're just gonna throw this right up to these vertical walls, feed it line and just let it go down. We're in 37 feet. But what we're trying to do is we're trying to get it caught on a rock or a ledge where there's a fish, all right? So we're just trying this. We're going to go through a number of steps to try to catch a fish. So, so there's, you know, when it hits, hits in that certain area, if there's a fish there, he's going to take it. So if it doesn't take it right away, reel it up and throw it again. You might have to do 10 or 20 different flips. Just throw that up and just let that go down. As you're falling down this, you know, you can see that up on the rock where there's ledges and stuff. Well, that's down below us here. So as it goes down and hits that ledge, let it sit there a little bit, jiggle a little bit. You don't get bit started. Oh, there's a bite. Right there. I wasn't even doing nothing. I was just dead sticking it on that, on a little ledge down there is all I'm doing. He's not big, he's... Came out of pretty deep water. I'm in 37 feet, so I'm not gonna keep him out, but just a nice little bass. Um, hopefully we could get one bigger, but just kind of let him go and go back down real quick. You don't want to hold him out of the water. So you can see what this did. This drop shot slid right down on the weight. And now all you have to do, it never gets tangled. Pull it back up. Hook your worm back into the hook. Like this. And you're ready to go again. Never gets tangled. So just flip, flip that right back out. Let me get another cast in there. You gotta get close to the rock, folks. There you go. Get it right next to the rock and just let that fall. Let it go down. And I may have to flip 50 more times to get a bite. So we're gonna just run this, run this down and just keep going. And then uh, when I get one, I'll turn the camera back on, all right? To show you what I got them on. All right, all right, we're back. We're going down the wall. I just had a nibble here and I threw back right back to the same same place. And that don't happen very often, folks. I missed it on the first bite and I got him on the second. And that does not happen. He's a little bit bigger than the other one. They're very lethargic. Choke my line. <laughs> That's what I get for flipping them in, huh? You get a two and a half or so. And you try flipping them in and you lose them. But anyway, got to see them. So with that, I'm gonna retie and go down the rest of this bank. I had to go quite a quite a bit down this and I was using morning dawn. So maybe I'll try uh, sangria now, purple. That's this one color here. I like two colors. I like the morning dawn with chartreuse, I dip it on the side, and I like the sangria. So, and I always put a little stain on the back. So let me, let me hook up, and then we'll go back to fishing. You know, wait a minute. I was gonna say, as the day goes on, you could start wiggling your worm a little bit more. Oh, he's up here already. These fish have moved up. Oh shit, he's heavier than I thought. I just busted off the other one, so I'm just gonna lift this one in. He's not a giant, but he's in the two pound range. A lot bigger than I've been catching at Bartlett. But just to go to show you, 
Guys, you need that little bitty oomph to catch that fish. Just set that hook just a little bit, you know, just a little small jerk, and it'll put it right in the top of that lip. So that's on a Sunset Sangria. We caught this in 20 feet of water. So just a nice little bass, nice and green, nice and bright, nice color. So there, there's fish up shallow and there's fish real deep. I fished for the real deep ones today. I did not catch any. Um, other than that, you know, come on up, give it a try. I haven't caught anything shallower than 15 feet. So go from 15 to 21, come out and you can see we're just fishing. Just, we were on the steep stuff and now we just kind of went around, we hit the rock and we're just moving around. So come up, give it a try. Pick out your favorite 5150s, put that uh, yellow dip it on the back and uh, come up and have a good time. Thanks for watching my videos.